Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Death Must Die. I'm Heron Steinbear, and Act 2 is out. That's right. They've released Act 2 of Death Must Die, which means that we've got a all-new uh, playable class to play, new god, but the biggest thing, new map here. Uh, they've also done lots of quality of life changes, completely overhauled just about the uh, the item system, or the uh, boon system, I should say. Uh, so we will be moving into the endless desert. Hopefully we can try out the, the new god that's there. I'm going to do it without any of the uh, additional difficulties turned on, just so that we can check out this new class. Like I said, hopefully get that new god, and uh, you got to... Decent amount of pretty cool items here. Extra dash we get with that. Some extra adept offers. Things like that. Uh, this one's really cool. Dashes spawn a lightning orb. So, yeah, we'll be trying those out uh, as Lorian. Lorian? Lorian, I think his name was. Yeah, Lorian. Got a little bit of a desert action here. So he is an archer. He is also the brother of... Uh, what kind of legend would it the pyromancer. I can't remember her name yeah. at the moment. Let's see. I will. Uh, I think maybe I will take. I'll actually alter that. Go with Legon. Your tax hits have a chance to create tornadoes that pull in and damage enemies. So they've also added a bunch of new uh, abilities, which I think is super cool. So I'm looking forward to trying out all of those. We got our first mini boss here. There we go, another level. You really want me to... Uh... Uh, so yeah, this is what I was talking about, about the new uh, skill system. So like you can apply three effects to your strikes, uh, multiple effects to your power, to your cast, and... Uh, you have just your passive abilities down here. So everything is sorted out for you nice there. Uh, we're going to go ahead at this point to take... Actually, we'll take Flare. We'll give it a shot. We'll see how Flare does. A little bit of passive damage there. I do like those tornadoes. Man, I don't want all these different gods. I want the new one. The new one is a... a Earth Goddess, I believe. Ooh, that one seems cool. Cast lightning orbs at random, or after dashing a chance you gain a status that gives you increased attach attack chance triggers on your next attack. Let's go ahead and go for the split second attack. I like the sound of that. Ooh, what is that thing? What the fuck is that thing? Get out of here, you oyster shell looking motherfucker. God. All right, we got him. We got him. Everything's fine. It's fine. I'm a volatile spirit. You, uh, on the other hand, seem quite dependable. I feel like it's new art for Lee Gong. Is it? Maybe not. Uh, chain lightning. Yes, please. Chain lightning's real good, especially I would think with a archer. An oyster man is back. Eight. Yeah, I hear oyster. Oh, what is the fucking noodle genie? The hell are you? Osmosis Jones looking motherfucker. Get out of here. Leave me alone. Okay. We'll take that heart though. Must destroy. So yeah, all new enemies here too, it looks like. It's not just the same enemies on a different map, which is really cool. Uh, we'll go Chain Lightning again. Dark Matter Cauldron. This might be a new one too. A giant cauldron filled with mysterious liquid. You can feel its power calling you. Uh, let's go... Let's go with extra power. Extra damage to our powers. Because we got a bunch of those. That split second attack is pretty fucking cool, honestly. Oh, oh, we got a blue genie. We got a blue genie. Oh, God, I'm frozen. I don't like that. Get away from me. Get away from me, I said. 
There we go. Hit you a couple times. Get you out of here and grab the chest. Let's go. We got summer back. Uh, faster attack. Might as well. Let's do it. Yeah, especially with the split second attack on there. Get us lots of attacks here. Kill the fucking genie. What is this? Glaring seal. Having to level up just right then. I don't think I want to take winter. I don't want to fill up all my gods with not this, but I have to now at this point. I've already used all my alterations. Maybe your dash is a chance of frost ring spawns. Mm, sure, let's do that. We have increased powers as well. Glaring seal plus 4%. Attack damage. Love that. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Okay. Is this another same thing? Extra dash damage. Okay. Especially because our dash does things. We have the, uh, the lightning orb from our dash. So I'm assuming that's affected. Hey, it's Jafar. What's up, buddy? All right, all right. Uh, I don't really love any of these. Maybe Breath of Fire, actually. Because if they're getting too close for comfort, Breath of Fire will uh, help take them out. Get a couple of those lightning orbs over there. Yeah, we got gotcha. you. You're gone now. I mean, I'm not saying no. Never mind my sister. She was just asking uh, something else entirely different than what you may think you may have heard. Some sort of mix-up with the timelines. That sounds like gaslighting. Let's back to this timeline, shall we? That sounds like gaslighting. I think I just got gaslighted by fate. Pickups drop more often. You gain more control over your god offers. I do like the idea of that, although... I don't think I'm going to get any more. Uh, let's go with Serendipity. Let's get extra luck here. I don't think I can take any more gods is what I was about to say. Ooh, Queen's Remark. Some more lore. Love that. Desert Ogre. Oh, God. You died in a big puddle of green. Ooh. Uh, all right. Immobilized enemies take more damage. That seems really good. Uh, or chilled and or frozen enemies below a certain life threshold instantly shatter and die. That also seems very good. Uh, I'm going to go with the shatter thing. I kind of like the idea of that, especially because of that. My frost ring thing should uh, make once we kind of get that leveled up a bit i think it'll honestly be very strong because if we can increase that uh damage threshold to like 25 percent or even 15 percent, i think it'll be kind of a significant amount i wonder if it works on like the bosses too because they'll have a larger health pool so that nine percent will be a bigger deal there we go got another enemy dead Glaring seals plus four percent status damage. Fuck yeah, that's extra fire and ice damage, and the lightning. I think that does uh, might deal status as well. Giant fucking hippo shrine of the hippopotamus. A shrine to the powerful hippopotamus. Uh, colossal might. Your attacks knock back enemies for thirteen range or gain twenty max life. I think I definitely gotta go with the ma uh, knockback. Right. I doubt it'll be that much. But still, okay, we got that guy. We got that guy. Who else is coming after me in this? Oh, fuck. What are those things? I, are those like displacer beasts? Are they supposed to be like cat version of displacer beasts? Although I guess displacer beasts are also already like panthers, right? So that's already a cat. Fucking A, man. What are you things? What are you guys? Uh, I think I'll go with another, yeah, another level of chain lightning. There we 
we go. Got some guys dead there. Please don't shoot me with your laser beam. I don't want to be shot with your laser beams. No, thank you, laser beams. I need some healing really bad. Yes, I do. I need that healing really, really bad. Come on, get them down, get them down. There's the king of them. There's the king laser cat. Oh, God. Take out the laser cat. Oh, fuck. Fucking desert werewolf. Okay, I think I killed the laser cat king. Now I gotta kill fucking desert werewolves. Okay, ooh, we got some master abilities. So trail of fire or meteor shower at master rank. Um, hmm, I think maybe we go... Maybe we go meteor shower, I think. I may regret that later, but my dash already freezes. Guess I could have done a little fire and ass thing, but, uh, you know, here we are. Is this healing by any chance? Glimmering inside of the dancing tongues of flames kept alive for many years. The embers left behind shine with deep cosmic purple. I guess we'll go more status damage, especially because we got those meteors coming down, which should be setting folk on fire. Ooh, what is this? Plus 24% damage for 30 seconds. Okay, okay. I would love a little bit of like health regen. That would be pretty cool. Another damage surge. Oh, what is this? Plus four life healed. Thanks. Thanks, fruit basket. Okay. So far, so good. About to take out the troll king. He gone. Okay, we got a couple things over here. Ooh, more fruit. Another four health. Oh, is this a lot of health? Okay. Uh, no. A strange fish fountain. A shine to the fish. A destiny intertwined with the flow of the great river. Touched by the fates themselves. Let's go with an extra reroll. Like I said, I don't think we can get another god. There's a limit to how many gods you can have per run. I think we kind of hit that limit already, unfortunately. Hey, more life healed. God damn it. Stop shooting me with that thing. What the fuck are you? Holy hell, the curse looks horrifying. I don't want to be touched by that. Also, these fucking homing green flames are some bullshit man I would prefer not to be cursed god damn what is happening all right uh mm. let's reroll this more damage that only goes up to a 13%. I think, yeah, we just got to go with more damage, right? Okay, I mean, we're doing decent damage to him. We got him down by a third already. Definitely don't want to let that. Oh, God, we just took a ton of damage as we were moving through there. Oh, no, no, no. Leave me alone, please. Thank you. No need to chase me like that. Um, I kind of got somewhere to be. I, I can't get out right now. Ibis Harp of Serenity. Um, 
Okay, uh, a captivating sound draws you closer to what seems to be a magnificently crafted heart playing all by itself. You give in to its enchanting melody, but how much? Gain 10 movement speed plus 8 max health and 0.32 experience per second. Or sacrifice a random blessing, gain plus 29 movement speed plus 24 max health and 0.9% experience per second. I think I gotta take that, right? If only for the extra health that I clearly need to take out this fucking cursed piece of shit. I would rather not. I got him down to half. God, he's fucking scary. I am running away. Uh, let's go with dive. So I can get more frozen enemies. I am running. I am literally running away from you. You could just leave me alone. I am. I mean, I'm still hitting them. Oh, fuck. We got blue lasers on the cats now. Extra cast damage. Oh, God, he's here now. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I don't know what that is. I don't like that at all. Oh no, laser cat got me. No, how could you laser cat? I thought we were friends. Damn. Bruised ego, lose an attempt as Lorian. Man, that was rough, huh? Uh, I think we gotta try again, right? We gotta try again as Lorian. See if there's anything in the shop for me. More master offers. I don't know if that's really any better. Uh, gloves, because this we get 1.8. Oh, 6.9. Actually, that is way better. But we lose the evasion and experience gain. So, yeah, I don't know if it is actually better. Our boots here. Yeah, they are the ones that give us the extra charge. Doesn't seem like I haven't found a chest piece or a weapon for this character yet which is interesting hello everybody and thank you so much for watching the video today if you haven't already subscribed please go ahead and do so we're trying to hit a thousand subscribers and we're getting closer every day we can't do it without your help if you'd like to help the channel more directly you can join a youtube membership by clicking the link in the description getting access to the member exclusive discord early access to videos and a shout out in every video like jacob burns thank you so much jacob for your continued support i'll let you get back to the video and i hope you're all having a great rest of your day See ya. I'm assuming that they got to be out here somewhere, right? Hopefully we can find the new god this time. Plus 100% damage. Remember that without me, you are not I'm uh, fine. Without you, I'm nothing. Damage versus barriers and bosses. That seems like it could be huge for later on against somebody like the cursed the more you take from death's realm the more you can bring back into it in time you will succeed if time is infinite then yes in time i will succeed uh let's go ahead and try we'll do force Experience pull level is up. There we go. Take out some folks. We got Oyster Boy over here. You dead now. What's there to say about Koron? He's delusional. Uh, I mean, I want the, the I want the other one. 
on cooldown created time field whenever you gain a level gain a random blessing that one is really good honestly that one can get really fucking wild because it can be a random rarity too so you can get stuff that's like way above your level even I like those uh, like black darkness orbs that are emanating off of me. Those things are sick. Hey, stop that. Mystic Gate. Simple arc of stone, cold to the touch, stands before you and through it the mantle of the cosmos. We can gain damage, gain area, or gain duration. Let's just do straight up damage. That sounds the best to me. Oyster Boy, you're dead. And we kill the boss. Energy missiles. Your attack hits have a chance to shoot out aiming missiles that damage enemies. That sounds pretty good. Uh, warped attack. Your attacks become stronger and bounce between enemies. Ooh. That sounds real good. Yeah. Okay. Yes, please. That is fucking sick. There we go. All right. Fuck, they like bounce off the screen even if there's like no more enemies on the screen. Nomadic temp or nomadic temp, nomadic camp. You come upon a tent that some small and mysterious nomadic creatures have set camp in. They show kindness and want to share their meal with you and you politely accept. I think I will take the movement speed. Especially for an archer that feels pretty big. But there might be a flicker of flame behind all this ice. All right, Lady Justice, fine. On cooldown, you gain a shield that would prevents the next time you take damage. You store more life from all sources or your armor is increased. Let's reroll because I think she can give us... Uh, ooh, that sounds pretty fucking cool. I want to do the light rays. That sounds awesome. Shrine of the Jackal. A shrine to the menacing jackal. Just do straight up attack damage. Especially because of the bounce. Yeah. Beautiful. Extra movement speed for a bit. We're gonna all speedy now. Oh, those fucking beams of light are sick. Nice. All right, Krom. What you got for me? Your tax hit shoot out rupturing shurikens. I mean, rupture is so good. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and go with the shurikens. We kind of gotta. It's too good. Altar to the sun. Praise the sun. You feel the power within this ominous scarab monument. Plus 20% dash recharge speed. Yes, definitely going with that. Our boots give us an extra dash, but they reduce our dash recharge speed. So now we just kind of negated that downside. So now we just have three freaking dashes that recharge super quick. Oh, we do so much damage already. This is already a way better run. There we go. Jafar is here. Okay. Experience pull area increase. Yeah, let's do that one again. Oh, you know what? I should have done the random blessing again. That's all right. I like the experience pull area, especially like this early in, because we're going to want uh, to be able to pull those. More damage, yeah, more damage to bosses and uh, and barricades, definitely. Because it makes a big difference against these barricaded enemies and the ones with a ton of health. There we go, okay. Exploring the desert, looking for some places I can do stuff at. What are you? 60 evasion for 30 seconds. Wait, what? Is Lorian dating death? Uh, is, is, is what? We're going to go back to Krom. Swords, damage, and rupture enemies around. Blood swords, that is new, right? That's got to be new. We'll try it. I don't think that's, yeah, that's a new ability altogether. 
Nothing in the tomb. That's all right. We're just killing some trolls here. I'm digging this new map. I really am. It's just enough change to make it feel unique, you know, new enemies and stuff like that. But it still captures the same feel of the other map and the gameplay of the game of the game here. These ancient scriptures are pulsating with an evil power, and upon getting close, you realize there will be a price to pay. Lose 20 movement speed, but gain damage. Lose 12% area, but gain damage. Lose 4% gas re gas dash recharge speed, but gain damage. Or gain 4% chance. I'm going to do the dash recharge since I already have the bonus. I know it was negating the downside from our boots. But I think it's okay. I think we're good. There we go. Take out some scaly boys. What the fuck? Ancient crocodile carcass. That's a big ass crocodile. The skeleton of a mighty Petsukas buried in the sand. Its skull uncovered temporarily by the whims of the desert sand. Ancient Endurance, randomly lose minus one banish, minus one reroll, or minus one alteration, and get 35 max life. Uh, randomly lose Ancient Scales, one banish, reroll, or alteration to get armor. Ancient Jaws, lose one to get attack area, or it belongs in a museum, gain one level. Uh, I think I kind of like the idea of getting extra armor. Yeah, I think I like the idea of getting the armor. Personally, uh oh, uh oh, we are trapped. These are these fucking laser cats. That's right. I was like, what are these things coming at me? I forgot. Let the lady write her judgment in ink while we spill it in blood. Yeah, you tell him, Crumb. Crumb is such an alpha, Chad. Uh, Chains of War, Bloodlust, you gain attack speed for each ruptured enemy. That one's fucking great, especially because we have the uh, shurikens that shoot out behind. So then our attack speed becomes ridiculous. Okay. Fuck you, laser cats. Got the laser cats going away. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Ooh, this gives our shurikens pierce, making them even better. Dead laser cat. I feel like this build is already way better than the previous one. Insanely better. All right, something over here, another glaring seal, extra status damage. Glad I was able to freeze that guy. Okay, take you guys out. Desert werewolf, go away. Nobody's talking to you, man. Nobody asked you to come here. Yeah. Oh, God. Snuck up behind me. Oh, very nice. Extra cast damage. Ooh, that's health. Oh, no, it's not. It's nothing this time. It was health one of the times I used it. Sand sunken boat. You come across once a once opulently ornamented merchant boat, now pale and drowned in the sands of the endless desert, but still carrying the secrets of the great river of souls. Uh, let's go with more pickup drops. Because that will include health. And I could use some health. Never changes. Correct. Also, your nipple looks weird, friend. All right. Uh, ooh, master level blood lust. Attack speed up to 6.8% for each ruptured enemy. Fucking love it. All right. We'll grab this glaring seal. Get some more power damage. And then head on down this way to another glaring seal where we get more summon damage. Those are our swords. 
Been flying around beating the shit out of people. Chasing that troll right there at the moment. Oh my god, this combo with the bouncing and the fucking uh, shurikens is kind of fucking insane, to be honest. Extraordinary sarcophagus. An eerie aura embraces you as you approach what you understand to be the sarcophagus of none other than Azual himself. Will you dis disturb what lies inside? Uh, let's seek guidance from him. I am the pharaoh. Okay, I don't know what that did. What did that do? I don't know what that did. I didn't think I wanted to confront him. That seemed like a bad idea to confront an undead mummy in the desert. Wait, is that my friend? Oh, I bet I have that ability right now because of... Uh... Oh, I do. I have this. As well, Master Summon, the mummy pharaoh fights alongside you, cursing enemies with its attack. What? Oh my god, yes, please. Is that him? Are you Azual? All right, cursed. You killed me last time, but not this time. I got a mummy on my side this time. No. Fuck you, cursed. I'm not running away this time. I'm not a coward anymore. Okay, I'm a little bit of a coward. Please stay away from me. No, leave me alone. I don't wanna. Okay, I leveled up. I leveled up. Uncool down the damage of your summons increases permanently. Yes, please. We have a bunch of summons. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, an ultra blade masters of the desert. Attack damage, attack speed, or attack area. I'm gonna go more damage. Oh, God. He's all up in my shit. Please go away. Please leave me alone. I do see a heart up top. I love the looks of that. Come on. Kill this son of a bitch. Kill him. Kill him. Where'd he go? There he is. He's down. Heart's up here. I can get some healing. Beautiful. Okay. All right. All right. Another heart here. Get this stuff and then get the hell out of here. Beautiful. Oh, my God. That actually worked out really well. The cursed is down. Oh, further than we got last time. That's for sure. All right, uh, I guess not minute wise, but enemy wise, it's further than we got last time. Extra power damage. We got another glaring seal here. Dash damage. Take out those guys. Ooh, and a new level. Ooh, and they're all master. Master summons last longer. Like the idea of that energy missiles uh, or time field. Hmm. Uh, I like both of these options. Let's go with deathlessness for our summons to last longer because we also had the increased summons damage. So those kind of stack together. Extra movement speed here is big. Oh, are those our skeletons fighting with us too? Yeah, we got skeleton summons now too. That might be uh, a bonus ability though. Yeah, just taking out entire groups of enemies with that ricochet and the rupture and everything. Extra summon damage again. Huge. More max life. Love that. Ooh, and a book. Lore of the land. No. These are the guys that killed me last time. Fucking blue laser cats. There we go. I got the book. Oh, there's health. I will take the health, please. Careful messing with your fate, mortal. You are but men. Gods dictate your paths, not you or those despicable know-it-alls. Fuck you, Crom. God, I like. I hate that guy sometimes. He thinks he's so funny. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Trying to shoot those guys. All right. Blue laser cats are... Oh, no. Nope, still more laser cats. Yeah. 
Okay. All right. So far, so good. Ooh, we got a shrine to the jackal. Let's do more attack damage. Keep stacking that attack damage so we can take out enemies quick. Okay, there we go. Ooh, another level Lady Justice. If they champion you, they must see a heroic journey before you. All right, sounds good. Sounds good. Extra armor restored extra life restore or dash increases movement speed. Uh, let's go with extra life restore because that becomes an issue later on. Okay, great, great, so far great. We got a stone of power for extra damage here, a huge amount of extra damage. Another bookshelf with more lore. Ooh, taking them out, taking them out. Man, this is going so much better. So much better. Speaking of things going awesome, I just want to say thank you again to everybody who's been blowing up the channel lately. Uh, subscriber numbers are climbing quick. We're getting so close to that thousand subscriber count we've been looking for. Uh, when we get there, I'm going to do another live stream. I know it's been a while since I've done one. Uh, it's been hard to set up the time since uh, we're going to do that with the dash recharge again. Uh, set up the time since my wife and I had my son, but uh, yeah, a thousand. We're definitely going to celebrate that with a live stream. We'll do alteration ritual to get extra bonuses, extra bonus uh, abilities there. But I just wanted to make sure I actually said on screen how much I appreciate every single one of you guys watching, subscribing, all the things, smashing the like button. You guys are awesome. More summon damage. We're taking so much damage here. I don't like this. Just like random damage coming from all over the place is the problem. Uh, a more healing there. Beautiful. Trying to keep moving so we can keep finding ways to heal. I love a item for this character that gives me like heal on attack or something. I thought I had one, but maybe I don't. Maybe I swapped it out without realizing it. Wondrous parchment. The parchment seemingly looks at you as if you're the weird one. Uh, read the parchment or burn the parchment. Let's read it so we get the master offers. I don't think we really have enough master abilities to just be trying to bump master ability damage. Don't think we're there yet. Ooh, we got the stone of power here. Okay, here's some more healing. No, it's not. Fuck. Man, all oh, these... Uh... That's a shitty item. Fucking uh... homing... homing fireballs suck. Don't like those at all. Another level. Uh, let's do... Let's do the energy missiles. Extra damage for 30 seconds. Oh, this doesn't feel good. No, come on. Somehow we're still alive. Let's go with the divine shield. That should hopefully keep us alive for a little bit longer. Maybe we can find some health somewhere. That's damage. Ah, this isn't going to be health either. Status damage. Oop, that's health. Okay, coming back this way. Maybe somebody else dropped a health. 
Ah, the light you live in, mortal. I know, it's great, isn't it? Just coming down here and getting my ass kicked over and over again is super cool. Uh, let's go ahead and do more damage to bosses and stuff. The insect queen, huh? I don't like my chances here, but against the insect queen. Oh, what? What the fuck? I was dashing and you were just able to target me the whole time? Talk about some fucking killer tracking. God. Man, that was a hell of a run. I am digging that new map. I like that it's a little bit harder, too, so it gives you a reason to keep coming back. Hopefully you all enjoyed watching it as well. Let's look up. I think we should be able... Yeah, we can put our lore in here. There we go. Ooh. Oh, that's nothing, really. More summon damage there. The code. I don't think that's supposed to be like that. Yeah, I don't... I think that one's busted. It's unique. I don't know. Maybe I'll try it later. Anyway, Lore of the Land... Four of six, the lady then came and with her the tide, transforming the desert where death did reside. Marshlands, blossoms, and gr grasses grew tall, her presence a gift, a green over a hall. Uh, that had to be the insect queen, right? Tales come and go, empires fall, yet the desert proceeds, outlasting them all. Before magic stirred or legends were penned, first came the desert, a land with no end. Yeah, so I wonder if the insect queen was the final boss. That would have been cool if we could have beaten at that time. Oh, well. Uh, I did win one run here, so they've also added these little things. Looks like we need to beat the game with all the different characters to see what happens when we fill this up. Anyway, uh, so I will be working on that. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you smack on that like button. Tell me you like it. If you enjoy uh, content like this, go ahead and subscribe. Like I said, we're trying to get to a thousand. You can help that out for us. And if you want have any comments on this game or any other games you want to try or the new update, if you've been trying it out, let me know some cool builds you've been putting together or things you've seen in the update. I'd love to hear it. Uh, if you want to interact further with the Herrenstein Bear community, you can click the link down in the description to get access to our member exclusive discord, early access to all the videos I post and a, at our highest tier a shout out in every single video, like Jacob Burns. Thank you so much, Jacob, for your continued support to everyone else out there. Who's been liking, watching, commenting, and subscribing. You guys are awesome as well. So thank you. And until next time, I hope you all have a And until next time, I hope you all have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you then. Bye.